person pulled over and they took their horses out of the trailer. What is wrong with this person? Okay, what is up everyone? Welcome back to another video. And we are going to look at another 85 because I'm still in search of another bike. Hopefully you watched the last video. It'll be linked after this video is done. So go check that video if you haven't seen it yet. And we're off to Leftbridge, Alberta right now to go look at the Husqvarna TC85. It's pretty sweet. So, I don't know, it's what, six hour drive? In there, okay. So, uh, yeah, I'm taking you guys along for the ride. Of current now, and I'm so hungry. Ooh. So, we're gonna um, go to Timmy's and get I'm gonna get a bagel, but no, uh, two slices of banana bread as well. Two slices of banana bread, yep. Let me turn that one for you. Just give me a sec. Oh. That's I think that's everything. Oh, they have it. Yeah. <sighs> Thank you. They have the banana bread. Okay, okay, we're good. We're good. Successful Timmy stop. Okay. That's freaking awesome. <laughs> and the charger is already charged. Try the room. Have you guys seen that? Look at this portable charger for the Spark. what to look for when you're shopping for that used bike. So before you head out there to look at the bike, when you're on the phone or texting the seller, obviously- We are almost in the fridge watching this video uh, by Cameron Nima, and he's, he's got a really great channel, and this video is called How to Avoid Getting Screwed When You're Buying a Dirt Bike. So it's just a bunch of stuff to check for when you're buying a used bike, and it's a really great video, so I'll link his channel at the end of this video, and uh, yeah. Almost in left bridge now. Your destination is on the right. Okay, we just arrived. This guy has a pretty nice house. This guy's got a pretty sweet house. Okay, so okay, I'm gonna walk in there right now and check this thing out. I'm excited. since we put it in our truck. <laughs> Look at it, it's so beautiful. It's so beautiful. <laughs> okay, if you're wondering, it's a 2015 Husqvarna TC85. Oh my God, it's so beautiful. <laughs> And the guy didn't even race and you put like all custom graphics on it for me. So thanks buddy for all the custom graphics. Uh, I'm still going to put my, my number on it if you don't know my numbers. 74. So yeah. Okay so also right now we're going to go to a dirt bike store to get boots because I sold mine because they're too small. 
Plus, uh, you know, I my boots are green to match my Cowie, but... Oh, and he gave us some new gears, and now I don't look like an idiot with Cowie gear and uh, Husqvarna. So... Okay, so what do you got here? Bar pad. Grips. Huskies. They got like everything. I don't really want to carry this thing around. Kevlar rental grips. Those are ugly. Yeah. Kevlar grips. Really sexy. Got new bar pad. I look really good on there. <laughs> Gloves, new fox gloves. Look really sweet. Then what's this again? Oh yeah, it's new fork seal kits. So okay, when we were there, we didn't really want to say it because the like, you know they make, make the guy feel bad. So, so the fork seals are actually a little bit leaky, and so it's leaking pretty bad. So we got some new fork seal kits. Other than that, great bike. bike and uh, just started dumping rain and so RIP NMDs. What are you doing now? Food I guess and so we, we have like a cover on our truck so we just put the cover over the bike so we because we stopped the Canadian tire to go get a tarp but so we just put the cover over it for now. I feel like it's gonna fly off though. So. It's kind of stopped now. Uh, as you can see back there, got the bike all tarped up. And update you guys when we get home, and then we'll kind of go over the bike when I get home. So, yeah. Okay, everyone, so next day we made it home. So I'm gonna put on some of my new gear and just go for a little bit of ride on the new bike. Also, I've never rode an 85 before, so this could be a little bit interesting. Maybe a little tippy, but anyways, let's do it. but other than that it's a great bike and yeah I'm gonna end off this vlog make sure to like subscribe comment and share with your friends and I will see you guys in the next video